Well, you know, everyone has dreams. I wanted to be a pilot when I was a little kid. I wanted to be a veterinarian. I wanted to be an NBA, play basketball. I always wanted to be an archaeologist. Be an astronaut, be a pilot. And when I was younger, I guess, you know, I was always hung around the fire station and then I wanted to be a fireman in the beginning. As you grow up, you think your dreams change. <laughs> I knew I wanted to be in the electronics world. I just didn't know exactly where, what aspect. I always wanted to be in business. I always wanted to work behind a desk and, you know, help people. I like gadgets all the time, playing with the electronics. And ever since I started working with computers, they fascinated me. Yeah, I love electronics. You have to have something that inspires you. I'm currently a network administrator. We take care of machines when they're not functioning properly or not functioning at all, and we attempt to fix them, and most of the times we do. I really kind of saw that this was a different, a different section of working with computers. It wasn't programming, it was networking. And that was something that was more along the lines of what I wanted to do. What I do is support users with uh, Unisys in uh, a user environment. If they have trouble with their desktops or laptops or anything like that, what we mainly do, we're dispatched there to the scene to uh, fix the problem. Whatever issue it may be, hardware, software, uh, pretty much anything. It's my job to make sure that those servers are available um, at all times and that there's minimal downtime. Technology is improving every day. Uh, the biggest challenge is to keep up. There was a lot of interaction with different people. Um, people call you, they have a problem, you go up and you help them. It's satisfying to know that you've helped somebody and to them, you know, that was amazing. But to you, it's just something you do. There's something satisfying about that.